Hi, welcome to Balance Your Life. I'm Debbie Peterson, founder of The Wellness Gala. About 16 years ago, I was introduced to holistic modalities, which were desperately needed in my family at the time. The results changed my life. My mission then became to educate the public about these holistic modalities and how they can work in conjunction with traditional medicine. I started Wellness Gala events nationally because I really wanted to share what I had learned with as many people as possible. When the pandemic hit, stress and anxiety had never been higher. We could no longer have our events to spread the word about these options at a time when people really needed them the most. So my team and I developed a TV show. Each week, we'll be bringing you experts in the fields of holistic modalities, integrative medicine, healthy food, beauty, and wellness. So join me along with my team, Barb and Dina, and celebrity guest host, Conchetta Bertoldi, a New York Times bestselling author and renowned medium. Hi, we're here with Masa Jati again. Hi, because- Mas. Hi, Mas. Hey, how are you? And Mas, we know that sometimes you're called a quantum futurist. Do you want to tell us what that is? Uh, sure. Uh, you know, well, you know, there's, uh, there's people who can see into the future, you know, like say, uh, there's psychics that can see into the future, but then quantum futurists, they actually look at data, like, like a Ray Kurzweil or some individuals like that, right? They can kind of predict the future from the past. And that's what scientists do. Uh, quantum futurists actually, uh, are a little different. I can see the future, but then I can see also possible realities that are available to us so most mm-hmm. individuals again like psychics and then quantum futures like ray kurzweil and everybody else they it's more linear mm-hmm. so they see the past and then scientists they they predict the future depending on what's happened in the past again it's more linear if that makes sense to you i can see yeah. the future and then i can see the possibilities other future possibilities for you as well and that's how i shift and tra- transform people by the way Wonderful. That's what I was just going to ask if you could tell everybody how you work a little bit to help everybody be limitless. Oh, absolutely. Uh, So that's that most most individuals, uh, again, you know, like theory of, you know, uh, you know, theory of physics literally tell you that, you know, uh, an object in motion tends to stay in motion in that same direction uh, as long uh, if there's no other forces acting upon it. So, again, you just recreate your future depending on your past. Again, it's more linear. Okay. Does that make sense to you? So the yes. mistakes and the issues that you've had in the past and then your parents have had in the past and stuff, just perpetuate your your life in the future. Does that make sense? So you're not creating yeah. anything new. So what I see is like, yeah, I see you where you are, but then I also see all these other possibilities of you out here that you might not even know or some of some people do know, but they can escape. They don't know how to get out because it's not a psychology thing. It's not like a habit. It's not a belief system. It's not, it's not anything that you can do at a psychological level. It goes deeper into say your frequencies or how you render yourself in space time. And I know it gets a little out there, but uh, more and more people are starting to realize that it, you know, it's all about frequencies. It's all about say, uh, uh, you know, different dimensions, uh, you know, different realities and so on like that. There's lots of movies coming out. Uh, based on mm. as well, right? Right. Yes. That's right. Mas, are you able to help people to help themselves? Oh, absolutely. That's what this is all about. Uh, mm. I would be that guide. Um, yeah. And, and and as a note, you know, in a spiritual community or even in the self help community, you know, people go, "Well, you can't do it without me," or you know, "You, I always have to be with you," or all that. I mean, that's not mm. true. You know, so kind of stay away from that. Uh, but yes, what we do or what XI does, exponential intelligence, well, exponential intelligence or the science of allows you to become exponentially intelligent. So you can do this on your own. I would be your guide, definitely. Right. right. Awesome. And that's really important because, again, most most situations, self-improvement or anything else, it's like they take power away from you and mm-hmm. they don't always need them and you'd always be supported by them. Yeah, not a good way to be. Don't, right. We don't want anybody to go to any of those people. No. Yeah. So you want, I, I give them the power to, you know, uh, and give them the tools to do what they want with whatever they want to do. So. That's excellent. And it's so important. But before we get any further into this, because we could just keep asking you questions because it's <laughs> fascinating. 
Yes. We heard that since the last time we saw you, when you had two near-death experiences, there has been a third. Right. And we'd like to know <laughs> about that, Moss. And how does that happen? Yes. yes. <laughs> I know. It's kind of crazy. I need to start. It is doing crazy. That. <laughs> um, but yeah, and you know, we're in Peru, or be even before I went to Peru, Faye, you know, um, um, I, I told Faye that, uh, uh, my fiance, I told her that, you know, something's going to really happen. Something big is going to happen. And wow, really? lo, and lo and behold, I went to Peru. We had a great time, you know, a lot of awakening. Uh, and then I ended up in the hospital, uh, in a, oh. Um, yeah, it was pretty crazy. And, you know, I, I stepped out of my body again. Uh, and I could literally see my body, like I was hovering over my body, looking at my body, and looking at my son holding, you know, holding my hand and so on. Uh, mm -hmm. And, then, you know, I just disappeared for I don't know how long. And they actually tracked, uh, they did a brain scan, I think, while I was out of my body. And oh, my, wow. brain, my brain scan was literally like, like mush there was nothing there like well basically of, of a oh. dead and then so they were really afraid of like what the hell happened but then i must have stepped back into my body you know or pushed back in and then they did another brain scan just to be sure and it was like pristine like that hmm. of an individual so uh a lot younger than you know my age which is actually yeah. one of the benefits of working with xi you actually start to look younger and younger Moss. Was that a choice for you to step back into your body or you do not recall? Um, I think I've used, or well, I don't think I know, I've used near-death experiences to elevate or okay. escalate uh, uh, my abilities. Uh, that's one way to do it. Uh, again, I, you don't want to just create a near-death experience for you thinking that it's going to help you. So for the right. audience listening, you just don't want to step in front of the bus and go, oh, oh no, no. <laughs> it's not going to help you. Uh, in fact, there are, you know, thousands of near-death experiences that happen every day, you know, tens mm -hmm. of thousands, actually. Uh, but uh, again, you you have to be awakened to a certain level. You have to be uh, 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 know what's happening. And then when you have that near-death experience it allows you to again escalate to a much much higher level of awareness or awakening so so that third near-death really allowed me to uh well see things from a very very different perspective and this is where people have been told uh, have been telling me that my abilities have transformed quite a bit you know yeah, oh really uh they're much more potent i can see things easier i can I can say render or rewire people uh, a lot easier, a lot better. Uh, wow. So it, it was pretty quick back in the day. Moss, that's what I was going to say. From where yeah. we sit, it was pretty seamless all along. So <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. So like, really? How, how much better can you be? <laughs> yeah, so it's more efficient now. I can work on, say, more people at the same time. Uh, um, I, I can see things easier. Where like, well, just to give you, you know, kind of a timeline, when I first, after my second near death experience, and then after I figured it all out, you know, it took me about maybe about half an hour to get into, say, a state, right, okay. of, of awakening to see things, because that's what happens. Uh, and then it would take me maybe an hour, hour and a half to work on somebody. Uh, so uh, even like, say, a few months ago, or say a year ago, uh, I would, that hour and a half, I could do it in about, say, five minutes. And I don't have to get into the state. I can just tap into or just be in that state right away. So I don't have to, like, meditate. I, I'm just in that state. It's always. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. That's incredible. Yeah. So now that's even faster. Uh, I can yeah. I can see people faster. I can read people faster. Uh, I can I can rewire, say, the masses, you know, like bigger mm -hmm. Right. So you have to reach, you want to get to those larger audiences then and have the trickle down effect. Absolutely. Yeah. So, so those are some of the changes of my abilities. Uh, plus, you know, I, I understand more. So for the user experience, people who, who, um, it's more of a smoother transition, you know, it's like less detox or less transfer. It's more like they're different and mm -hmm. They just feel that they're different. They don't have to go through a state of change or, again, mm -hmm. detox or recovery, so to speak. 
Wow. <laughs> I, so, so, I mean, we're both speechless. Now yeah. that the, the, the outcome or the process has changed a little bit, what is your plan? How did, how did that change on how you're working with people and reaching people? Uh, good question. Well, my company is revamping itself, you know. Uh, okay. We're working with more influential people because, you know, if you can work at people, uh, what, what we're finding out with XI is like when you transform, people around you transform. Absolutely. Not, does that make sense? I mean, you. Yes, yes, absolutely. I was, I don't know if you heard me before I was saying that. I feel like, are you moving towards larger audiences and the trickle down effect, so to speak? Yes, absolutely. So. Yeah. And, and that's the key. So, you know, like say I work with high level CEOs, you know, that, you know, they have yes. like tons of employees. So when you change that CEO, their company transforms and then their employees transform. That's fantastic. That's excellent. That's excellent. Which makes you more in demands now. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. We, <laughs> gosh, you know, as of last count, we've got a couple thousand people on the waiting list. So we're trying to figure wow. out how to do work throughout more uh mm -hmm. you don't need a one-on-one -on -one session with me right now yes to transform you know we have like the 18 day meditations the event that we're going to be doing yes uh, coming up. those those kind of things where we can do group sessions with 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 massive transformations for people right because you can hit reach more people that way that's excellent it's really more important now it the is type of group session that we're doing for everyone to come to join us to see moss yes because well we're excited I'm yeah very excited. we're very excited because yes. we're going to do an online event with you on thursday december 1st this is so yes. exciting because i feel like we you know having this event that we're going to have on yes. december 1st we are really um joining Moss at the forefront of what he's doing next. And, and it's incredible to be part of it. Yeah. And I mean, our audience is more the New York metro area. So, I mean, we'd love to have you come back in person <laughs> eventually. Well, I'd love yes. to yes. For sure. Yeah. I don't think you've been here in a while. So this will be great chance for people to see you, uh, you know, some of our audience. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So, well, we look forward to it. And you want to tell everybody how they can find out more about you? Uh, yeah, they can go to, again, masajati.live. That's the best place to the YouTube okay, channel. Okay. Uh, they can go to xisuccess.com. Uh, okay. They can go to, they can listen to my podcast, which is Exponential Intelligence, uh, masajati.com. Oh, uh, different ways. Multiple There's ways. free stuff that's there for you. Just Wonderful. listening, just listening, by the way, to those, um, uh, to the talks will start mm. to shift and change you for sure. So. Great. Everybody We're so go. looking forward to it. Yeah. And thanks for being on today to talk about it and, and everything else. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Thanks, Moss. Thanks, we'll be Moss. right back. <laughs> and we'll be right back. Hi, everyone. Here we are with Barb. What are you making us today, Barb? So today I'm going to be making a red sangria. It's an apple pear sangria. Mm. And it is so delicious. You're going to love it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get a bottle of red wine. I just happen to have a Spanish red blend here. Okay. Sangria is from Spain. So you want to pour that into your pitcher. Then I have sliced up two apples and two pears. And Deb, if you would like to sure. help me, yep. you can slice up Some another smart. orange. Okay. We're going to place all of this fruit into our pitcher. And you see how I've sliced these apples almost like little french fries, yeah, just for fun. And I just fun. throw this in? Yep, just I throw will. them in. Okay, okay. And then you want to just push the fruit down. Okay, one more good one here. Good, one more mm. good one. And I also have a cup of fresh orange juice. Mm. Right. So the other thing that we're going to want to do is rim the glasses with cinnamon sugar. You don't have to do this step, but, but it does so make good. Yeah, it, it, it is makes so good. it. Yeah. It really makes it. So you're just going to take a piece of orange, put it around the rim. I have some cinnamon sugar here. Boom. That easy. So then that goes in your refrigerator for four hours to marinate. And I'm going to put orange slices on the rims of my glasses. Pretty. And then this hasn't been marinating, but if it had been marinating, <laughs> what I'm going to show you is you're going to fill your glass. We'll just do a small glass. Okay. 
and then you want to add a splash of seltzer. That's about it. That's it. You can that's put it. some fruit inside. That's what makes it, that's, we always say that's the best part, <laughs> right? You just put a little bit of fruit in there, and there you go. Good to Yum. know. Looks great. Yeah. So, okay. cheers. All right, cheers. <laughs>Hear and read a lot about the road to motherhood, but in my experience, fertility and postpartum anxiety are glossed over by many experts. I'm Dr. Christine Dollahan. I'm an intuitive energy healer, a trained postpartum doula, with a PhD in transpersonal psychology. If you're looking for support before, during, or after pregnancy, please contact me. I'd love to help you create a life with your child full of confidence and purpose. With us today is Barb Minnemeyer, a holistic health and wellness expert who helps men and women lose weight and feel good in their bodies again by counting chemicals, not calories. We love that, Barb. So yeah. welcome. Yeah, Hi, thank Barb. you. It's yeah. good, good to, to be, be here. here. Yeah. So nice to be here. Yeah. So Barb, I've known you for years. Yeah. I know you've been doing the wellness galas for years. So um, I love everything you do. And I think you bring so much knowledge and information to people. Mm -hmm. So, but I would love you to just dive in and tell everybody in your own words what you do and how you got started. Okay. Well, how I got started, like most of us, as you know, <laughs> either we have an issue or, or a family member has an issue. So true. And then yeah. you have to dig the deep dive, do the research, look it up, check it all out. And right. I was actually, you know, I've had IBS, leaky gut, candida, I mean, I've had yeah, a lot, okay? Yeah. And uh, and then I got, you know, interested in checking that out and learning more, but then um, a friend of mine asked me to go with her when she went to uh, open house at uh, Institute of Integrative Nutrition. Okay. So I went with her to support her in that, and I sat there, I was like, oh my, Dr. Mark Hyman, Dr. Joel Furman, all the big guys were mm, our right. teachers. Oh, cool. And I was like, oh my God, like all the things that you don't know that you don't know, I was learning. Mm -hmm. And I was appalled at what was happening with our food. And that's how it all started. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And, but I mean, you have an awesome uh, tagline, slogan, yes. whatever. Yes. Yes, Counting because, chemicals. you know, everybody, when they look at the at foods, they look at the nutrition label. Well, how much fat, how many calories, mm, right. and then they run with it. Nobody goes down to the ingredient label, what really tells you what's in your food. And that's where we have to put our focus. Right. You okay. find all kinds of sugars in there. Hydrogenated oils. I mean, who wants gas blown into their oil? Right. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's, it's crazy stuff. Right. And it's just, and, and these are the things that are making people fat and sick are all these ingredients. Right. And natural mm -hmm. flavors is another one. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I was gonna say, why don't you tell us a little bit? Yeah. Well, yeah. natural. No. I've always heard that you wanna get the, the least amount of ingredients on the package is the best mm -hmm. way to go. Five ingredients or less is right. always better. Oh, when okay. you get a list that's like this long, put it back on right. the shelf. Okay. And if it has natural flavors on it, put it back on the shelf. Really? Because yeah. We have found that over 100 different chemicals hide behind that label. Uh -huh. mm. And the FDA, between the food companies, what they're doing, and FDA that gives them all these loopholes and permission to do it, they're really contributing to the... Not right. being honest. Yes, yeah. exactly, really honest. exactly, yeah. and our poor health in this country. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about what do you help people with? Well, you know, a lot of the conversations I have with people, they come to me and they're either, they're bloated, that's number one, brain fogged, fatigued mm. and joint pain. Those Sounds are like four. everyone. Yeah, <laughs> it is. I have all of uh, it. <laughs> yeah, it is. But Great. see, here's the deal. These are all symptoms of inflammation. Uh -huh. And we can't ignore that. If you're having any of those symptoms, I mean, it takes 10 years to finally get these symptoms that are coming out. Mm -hmm. It takes a long time to get inflamed. Mm. It's like build up after build up of the chemicals and the toxins in the food, huh. you know, that, that happens. and. Um, and those are symptoms of inflammation and you really need to address it. And that's the root cause of, oh, you feel most of the, yeah. Food is at the root of all of all disease. Yes, okay. it and it's also medicine. Right, it, depending on what yes. you're eating, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. I yeah. mean, food causes it and the right foods will heal it. Right. And that's what you help people do. You help them heal. Oh, absolutely. Say, right. I work with them, we get on a plan, you know, mm -hmm. they keep a food log for me and, you know, I'm um, sure it's customized, right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. To what their needs are, and, and it's really symptoms. whole clean foods. You have a meat, right. you have a fish, uh, meat. You have chicken. Then you have your vegetables. Then you have your grains, 
And as long as you're not mixing it up with maple syrup and all this other stuff, you, you'll be fine, you know? Uh -huh. but right. It's all the processing foods that's right. really... Well, and natural food has sugar in it, ha natural sugar. Yeah. You know, you shouldn't need to put any mm -hmm. extra on it. Exactly, that, you know? exactly. But people like to sweeten everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we do. So tell us about, I know you do a detox. Can you oh, talk yeah. about that? Yeah, I'm bit? really passionate about my detox because, you know, people learn through their own experience, right? Mm -hmm. So right. when you can go through a two-week detox with me, okay, we take out the gluten, the dairy, the nightshade vegetables, caffeine and alcohol and everybody always groans oh I can't do that for two weeks I'm like for two weeks you can do anything right. and like you have things like organic chicken wild caught fish fruits vegetables nuts hummus all kinds of goodies right and you know recipes and everything I give them to help them to do that mm -hmm. but what happens is is that within the first week people start to feel better the bloating starts to go down the brain mm. they have more clarity and they have more energy and they sleep better. The whites of their eyes get whiter. Their skin clears up. And this, I mean, in two weeks, these are the results that my clients get from doing the detox. Wow. Yeah, that's it's, great. It, it is amazing. Yeah. And so, and why, you know, I like doing it is because when you can have that experience, you'll remember that. Mm. So when it hits the fan for you again down the road, right. when you deviate, <laughs> yeah, right. you'll know yeah. what to do to get back on track again. Yeah. Right, exactly. You'll remember how you how great you felt mm -hmm. and want to go back to that. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. exactly. And these are virtual. How 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 do you do these detoxes? It's they are they are virtual because we get like you know nineteen twenty plus people in it. Mm -hmm. So for us to be able to meet. You know, we do it through a Zoom. Mm -hmm. I set up a Facebook group. I put recipes in there. I put Great. videos in there That's, because yeah, wonderful. they're powerful. They don't want to hear it just from me. When I bring in Dr. Mark Hyman videos, Dr. Mm -hmm. Joel Furman, and people get to see that, you know, this is, this this is, is the way the, to go. This yeah. is the way to go. Yeah. This is the way uh -huh. it is, you know, so, mm -hmm. yeah. And, and how often do you do the detoxes? I do them three times a year. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah. So I'm sure people so can find out about them on your website. Yeah, they can yeah. go to my website. There's a tab up there, Seasonal mm. Detox, and you can always find out when the next one is. That's great. That's Absolutely. great. Yeah. Yeah. I'm signing up. And we have a great community of people that do it. I have people yeah. that keep coming back all the time. Right. They love, they right. love doing it. We need it. to do it. Yeah. 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 I, I, I actually, should do it together. I, yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And um, also, didn't you want to talk about, you made some of Barb's yes, recipes? Yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes. On the show, I made, I do the cooking. I do cooking segments, and I actually made your lemon bites. Ah, which we love. aren't they great? Yes. Oh, yes. I know. They're so good that I've made them literally probably three times since, and I <laughs> yeah. have them in my freezer. Yeah, there's only four ingredients. Yeah. yeah. Dates. Cashews, almonds, and lemon juice, and that's it. And yeah. it's like a party. And they're delicious. Like a party yeah. in your I know mouth. you always it, give it, them out it is. at the gala yeah. for I samples. Do. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I always yeah. make them Amazing. and have them there with the recipe for people to take. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that Fantastic. they can make them. Yeah. 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 I always put a little extra lemon juice in mine because I like them really soft and lemony. But yeah. They're so delicious. The yeah. lemon juice is really the secret ingredient. It Without is. that, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. All right. So, Barb, do you have some tips for our audience? You know I do. Okay. <laughs> but my, my parting tip is that really getting the right practitioner is so key to, mm -hmm. to getting the results that you're looking to get. Mm -hmm. Because quite honestly, I mean, we have 135 medical schools in this country. Only four of them have nutrition departments. Uh, yeah. Doctors wow. only get two hours of nutrition counseling. Can you imagine in mm -hmm. their medical training. So I always recommend functional medicine doctors mm. because they really know how to connect the dots. Mm -hmm. You know, right. like if you got your hormones going on here and you're gotten headaches over here and you got this gut going on over here, <laughs> they know how to what testing to do to make because it's usually one root cause that all these different things are coming out mm. of. Really? Interesting. Oh yes. Yeah. And they know what tests to run to zero in and see exactly as it is instead of being sent to one doctor over here another one over here, right. and this one over there. Before you know it, you're on four different medications, and really all you needed to do was stop the gluten, stop the dairy, mm. eat whole fresh foods, and eat more fruits and vegetables. Right. Yeah, wow. it sounds simple, so yeah. everybody yeah. should really, yeah. I mean, it is simple, but nobody's <laughs> telling anybody. Nobody talks about it. Nobody well, talks we about are, it. so yeah, we appreciate it. Yeah. Like case in point, if I could just point, mm -hmm. I, I can't tell you how many people I've talked to this past week alone who've been diagnosed with Hashimoto's, and mm. the doctor never told them to stay away from gluten. Gluten is a kiss of death if you have Hashimoto's. Wow, okay, wow. well that's good to know. It so. really is, so I just wanna 
yeah, no, you're, share that. It's, that's amazing. Yeah. So, Barb, tell us how people can find out more about you and everything you do. Well, you can go to my website, which is yourhealthytruth.com. Okay. And on Thank there, you. I have a lot of information and uh, and a handout, that you, a giveaway that you can get there as well. So. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, I hope everybody takes a look at that and really cleans up their diet a little bit, us included. <laughs> All right. Thanks for joining us. Thank thanks you for fun. having me. Yes. And we'll pleasure. be right back after this. It's time to unwind at Harmony Within Massage Therapy, located in Westwood, New Jersey. Relieve your headaches, stress, and pain with one of our many massage, skin care, and acupuncture services. Our professional staff are committed to improving your wellness in a calming atmosphere. Treat yourself to a customized session today at Harmony Within Massage Therapy. And use promo code wellness for 15% off your next visit. Do you suffer from headaches, stiff, sore joints, digestive disorders, recurring infections, emotional stress, or sleepless nights? Try Enzyme Nutrition. It's scientific, personalized, and has no side effects. Visit Susan Richter, RN, at nextlevelhealing.com. Read her reviews or reach out directly at 973-586-0626 to learn more. When I met Conchetta years ago, she told me your loved ones are always standing by to help you. All you need to do is ask. And she actually refers to this as air. And it is something I have never forgotten. So thank you. I use it literally probably every day oh, multiple wow. times a day that's fabulous so, yeah so tell everybody what you told me absolutely and, honey please. when you think of your relatives or folks you've loved and lost think of them as in the air you breathe and if you spell right. air a-i-r it stands for always in reach right they're not up in the skies and they're certainly not in the ground they're right here next to us at all times mm. that's how close they are wow and it's a wonderful feeling, you know, just to know. And I always tell people, you don't need me. They yeah. hear you. They're right here in the air you breathe. Right. They know everything you're thinking, you're feeling. And the one thing that I, I do know is that when we die, we are given a choice almost instantaneously uh, to choose God or turn your back on God. Mm -hmm. And once you choose God, you become one with the Spirit of God when you pass. Right. And that's the golden ticket, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> that really is. Right. I have seen you say this at your at different events, and you, I can just see people sort of exhale and say, "Oh, okay, they're always in reach. I can. They're right. always there. They're always there that I can and I can talk to them." And it's so right. good that you do that because you give once again give the people. Well, it's ah, hope. It's some right. Hope and Absolutely. Peace and it's just so simple and so mm -hmm. easy. And if and if everybody knew that, they'd be they would be rejoicing. They right. would be happy. Right. right, right. So everybody out there, remember air, always in reach. So if you have something simple you want to ask for or something complicated, you know, go ahead and ask. They're right there, standing by to help you. Yep. Or just lend a hand in whatever way they can. Right. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week when we chat with Conchetta. Body. Mind. Spirit. Full Spectrum International is here to help you feel relaxed and renew your presence. With everything in the world, you need a break. Call and book an appointment now. Full Spectrum International, raising positive vibrations. The Eclectic Boutique in downtown Montclair has handmade items locally sourced from area artists and entrepreneurs. It's the perfect place to shop for unique gifts such as one-of-a-kind jewelry, clothing, crystals, and organic skin and food products, plus much, much more. This charming store has something special for everyone, so stop in today or visit our website to see our merchandise and learn about classes and event offerings. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the show. See you next week on Balance Your Life.